Alright guys, we are headed to Toys R Us. I'm um, doing another toy haul out and about Legacy Quest video. Um, I also want to hit up a couple pawn shops to look for some movies and stuff like that. So uh, let's get this quest going, this journey going. Let's see what cool stuff we find today. And um, if we find anything. I know a lot of cool stuff came out as far as Power Rangers, like the new... Uh, Legendary Morpher with the 20 keys, the exclusive pack. Um, we'll see if we can find that, check that out, and um, see what else we can find. Alright guys, I made a quick stop at uh, Disc Replay. Felt like stopping in here. I'm going to see if there's anything I can find and try to get some footage if I can. Into Disc Replay, we are going. Too much money. Can buy it new for that. Pretty cool. Seven Alright guys, we just left Disc Replay. I'm heading to another pawn shop to see if we can find any more good deals. Um, hopefully we do. And uh, after this pawn shop, we will go to uh, Toys R Us. Alright guys, we are here at my local pawn shop, Cash Traders. There's some things in there that I really want. Uh, I'm going to go see if they have it. So uh, I really can't film in there. So at the end of this video, when I pick up the stuff, I'll show you what I get there. But yeah, mostly what I come here for is just movies and stuff like that. But there's something in there that I really want, and it's old school. So uh, yeah, so after the video, I will show you guys what I picked up. Alright guys, we just left the pawn shop. They had what I wanted, which is really cool. I'm really glad. Uh, now we are on our way to Toys R Us. We made it to Toys R Us. So let's go in there and see what good stuff we can find and and uh, check out. They got a lot of stuff. $80. Some cool turtles. Leonardo. Really cool Star Wars figures. Really cool. This is pretty badass.
This is pretty cool. I'm really not seeing anything today. I think I might have to head out. Well, they didn't have a whole lot, so uh, I did get one thing. And I'll show you guys that at the end of the video. Alright guys, we're here waiting at the light. Just left uh, Toys R Us. They didn't have a whole lot. Um, I did get one thing. They had the Legendary Morpher uh, key pack with the 20 Ranger keys. But, um, yeah, that was a little too much money. $80. I don't think I want to spend $80 right now. But we're going to head over to Target and see what they have there. Alright guys, so instead of going to uh, Target, I changed my mind and we're going to go to Best Buy. So we're here at Best Buy because I changed my mind. Alright guys, so I decided to come to Best Buy. I really didn't want to go to Target. Um, I changed my mind. I haven't been to Best Buy in a really long time. So I want to check out the movies and stuff like that. So uh, let's go. Space Jam. Alright guys, we just left Best Buy, um, I got two movies, I forgot why, now I remember why I stopped going to Best Buy, they're uh, a little expensive, <laughs> but um, yeah, that's it for today's video, I hope you guys really enjoyed it, uh, it's been a long day, pretty tired now, I think I'm going to go home, cook me something to eat, and um, yeah, call it a day, but at the, like, at the end of this video, I'll definitely show you guys what I picked up. Um, really wasn't much as far as like Power Ranger stuff. It was more movies than anything else. But um, yeah, at the end of this video, I'll show you guys what I uh, picked up. What's going on, guys? I am back. Um, it's been a long day for a toy haul. It wasn't much of a toy haul. It was more of a movie haul. But um, before we get this uh, show going, I'll pause it right here. Go grab something to drink. Come right back. Um, I got a lot of stuff to show you. Um, more movies than anything else. There really wasn't much for toys, um, other than the uh, legendary uh, Ranger key pack with the 20 keys and the morpher. Uh, really didn't feel like spending $20 on it right away. Not $20. <laughs> um, $80 on it right away. But um, I do plan on getting it. That's the thing I am getting. Um, I'm working on getting that right now. But um, I stopped at disc replay before I went to Toys R Us only because... Uh, it was kind of on the way, so I just made a little detour and stopped there. Um, got some film, you know, filmed in there. Sometimes I get a little creeped out because I feel like everyone's watching me when I'm filming and stuff like that. So uh, it's a little hard to uh, try to capture footage. Even at Toys R Us, there's so many people walking in and out of the aisles. And I'm like, you know, pause, put the phone in my pocket, take it out, you know. But, um, yeah, so let me show you guys what I got. I got a lot of good deals as far as movies. Um, a lot of sales going on. Um, I tend to try to buy my movies used, like on eBay or on Disc Replay, you know, pawn shops. You get, you know, movies for like $1.99, sometimes four or five bucks, depending on the movie. I go to Amazon, sometimes they got some cheap movies. I hardly ever pay $20 to $25 on a movie. But, um, yeah, so let's show you guys what I got at Disc Replay. And the first one is with Holly Berry, The Call. Um, really good movie. I really enjoyed it when I seen it. I seen it on bootleg. Um, I didn't go to the theaters or anything like that. Someone had it on bootleg, and I watched it. But, um, yeah, she she plays a, a police dispatcher. Someone, some little girl calls her for help. She got kidnapped. She's in the back of the trunk. And she pretty much takes um, everything that's going on to, like, heart and stuff like that. And, like, she helps, like, try to find the little, the, the little girl. 
um, stuff like that. But um, it's a really good movie. For $1.99, you know, you can't beat that. The second one is uh, Anchorman 2. Um, didn't see it. I heard mixed reviews. Um, I wanted to watch it. I didn't see part one. Uh, maybe I should have seen part one, but this was a dollar ninety nine, so uh, I took a gamble on it. And I tend to like Will Ferrell, so like Talladega Nights, that was a pretty funny movie. Step Brothers was hilarious. Um, another thing that I picked up was Saving Private Ryan. I have this on DVD, but uh, my whole goal is to sift through all my DVDs and turn them into Blu-rays. So uh, yeah, I seen this on uh, for four ninety nine on Blu-ray. This movie's really good. So if you haven't seen it, I suggest you guys probably watch that. It's a really, really good movie. And if you haven't seen Band of Brothers, the HBO TV show, it's kind of based off this, but it's based off the Airborne. This is based off the D-Day, the invasion on the beach, and the other uh, Band of Brothers is based off the 101st Airborne. Um, suggest you guys watch those, especially if you like war movies. Um, definitely get on that. And uh, the other movie is Black Hawk Down. Same thing, have it on DVD. Just Switching to Blu-ray. Really good movie. We Were Soldiers, same thing. Um, also really, really good. Really cheap. Uh, $3.99, I think I paid for for uh, this one in Black Hawk Down. Wind Talkers with Nicolas Cage. Also a really good movie. His whole duty is to protect the code, which the code was um, based off, I think, Cherokee Indian language. So he was paired up. Him and another guy were paired up with um, like Cherokee Indians with like where the code. So uh, his job was to pretty much keep them safe. Really good movie. Now we're going on to like comic book type stuff. A uh, movie that I've never seen that I really really wanted to watch and I will watch, and that's uh, Watchmen. Um, this was three ninety nine. It's like three ninety nine. And it still had the twenty nine ninety nine uh price tag on it from Best Buy. I peeled off the sticker. I don't like stickers on my movies. But um yeah, can't beat that. And it's the director's cut. So usually the director's cut has a little longer film. So yeah, twenty four minutes longer. So I'm definitely gonna get get on that. Kick ass two, funny movie. If you haven't seen Kick Ass One. Um, definitely watch that movie's hilarious. Part two was good, but not as funny as part one, especially the beginning. <laughs> the beginning was funny. And another thing I got, I paid thirteen ninety nine. That is um, the trilogy for the original remake of Spider Man, one, two, and three on Blu Ray. On Amazon, it's about twenty five to twenty seven dollars. So when it was thirteen ninety nine, I jumped on that all day. And I have The Amazing Spider-Man Part 1 and 2, which I really enjoyed. People didn't like Amazing Spider-Man 2. I don't know why. It was a good movie. Um, now we're going to go to the pawn shop. The other pawn shop that I went to, there was something there that I really wanted. And it was for a movie to watch at old school, collecting, when I have my house, movie room, uh, display, whatever you want to make, whatever you want to call it. And that is the Star Wars Trilogy on Laserdisc. Um, really, really epic. If you guys aren't familiar with Laserdisc, um, I'm not familiar with it myself. I haven't really read up on it too much. But I know it's from like back in the day. I think it's before DVDs. Um, they're pretty much, I'll open up one. And they're pretty much the size of records. It's front and back. But, um... Yeah, that's pretty much what it is. There's three in there, front and back. So everything's broken off into parts. Oops. Yeah. Well, there's nothing back there. Where did I... Oh. thought there was something behind it, but I guess I was wrong. And I also got there, uh, The Purge. Which I seen part one. Part one really sucked. Um, someone brought part two into work. Started watching it. Like man, you know, I had a, took a short lunch break and I couldn't finish it. And this is a movie that I always wanted to watch. So uh, when I seen it at the pawn shop, I jumped on it because it was cheap. 
Um, now we move on to Best Buy. Um, I normally don't do this. I paid full price for these movies. I shouldn't have done it. I should have waited. But um, maybe I should take them back and wait. Probably not, right? That's Maleficent on Blu-ray. Really wanted to see this movie. This is a cartoon remake into live action. Um, I believe it's Cinderella. I'm not 100% sure. I didn't watch the cartoons. Um, but I heard really, really good things about this movie. And I heard her acting was really good. And um, I like Angelina Jolie. She's a good actress. And um, yeah, so I wanted to get this movie and watch it. I don't know when. But I got so many movies that I gotta watch. We'll uh, we'll see when I get around to it. And the next one is Hercules. Another good movie. Maybe I should do a giveaway, huh? You guys like Hercules? It's PG thirteen. Uh, you guys watch the. The digital download. Maybe I'll start giving these away on my, on my, uh, on my toy hauls, whatever. My monthly update videos. I got good feedback on that, so I'm definitely gonna be doing that. Um, maybe I'll be giving away the ultraviolet codes to these movies. Um, cause I don't use them. They just go bad. They sit there. So if someone can put it to use, might as well, right? But um. Yeah, now we're going to move on to Toys R Us. What I got at Toys R Us, there really wasn't much. Um, but uh, I did get one thing that I wanted, and that is the White Ranger. I want the Titanium Ranger. I want the Red Turbo Ranger, and I want the Gold Zeo Ranger. The back. I think they're going to make a Falcon Zord next for Legacy. Um, I would not doubt if we see the Falcon Zord, if we see the Thunder Zords, the uh, Shogun Zord, and the Ninja Mega Zord. I'm pretty sure we're probably going to get those. Um, I hope we do, at least. Another thing I got in the mail, um, I wanted to wait to open with you guys. And that is, uh, I got something from Cody. So I'm going to open this up. that is the Power Rangers on VHS. Cody, if you're watching this, thanks, buddy. Thank you for selling it to me. Um, I have it on DVD. Um, I kind of like the old school type stuff on certain movies that I, that I personally like. And I know this VHS tape would bring back a lot of memory for you guys. Um, you know, so I'm probably going to watch this, you know, watch it on VHS. All the blurriness. It's a night and day difference when you pop in a VHS tape to DVD to Blu-ray and now 4K. There's a huge, huge difference in the, how technology has evolved, which is really cool. But, um, yep, I got this. Pretty happy about it. Um, if you guys really like this toy uh, haul video, um, you know, hit the like button. Don't forget to, you know, comment, subscribe. Uh, whatever you guys want to do. And um, I thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Take it easy. There's definitely a lot more Power Ranger stuff coming up. Um, Titanus. Saba. Tiger Zord. More Ranger Keys. More Legacy stuff. We got Dino Charge. I'm going to be going on a Dino Charge hunt pretty soon. Um, so we'll see if I'm able to find anything. I tend to, like every weekend, every Saturday morning, I tend to go to Toys R Us. People there probably get sick of me, you know, because I, I gotta look for this stuff. I gotta try to find it, you know. Um, I don't want to miss out on stuff and then have to pay a higher price later. But anyways, guys, I will see you guys next time. There's more stuff to come. Thank you, and take it easy.